Hello, my name is Susan Grison. I am a member of the MPCA affiliate Friends of Liberia, commonly known as FOL. FOL members, almost 3,000 strong, live across the United States and parts of the world. We are former Peace Corps volunteers, Liberians, and those who have a strong affiliation with Liberia. I was a Peace Corps volunteer in Liberia and Tonga in the early 70s. FOL sponsored an anthology project in honor of Peace Corps Liberia's 60th anniversary. I am the chief editor of the anthology along with co-editors and former Liberian volunteers Susan Corbett and Karen Lang. The book includes 50 contributing authors writing 63 short stories and poems about our Liberian life and service. For two years during the COVID pandemic, over 100 FOL participating members persevered virtually. And in 2022, we published our anthology, Never the Same Again, Life, Service, and Friendship in Liberia, just in time for our anniversary celebration. We wrote our book with Peace Corps' third goal in mind. Every short story or poem has a takeaway message. Our anthology is a great teaching tool with a map, a historical timeline, resources, glossary, and discussion questions. So we took our book and its messages to our communities and the world to inform others how serving in peace is vital and the importance of being a global citizen. Our contributing authors and supporters promoted our stories by speaking with family and friends, book clubs, schools, faith-based congregations, holding campfire chats, and community events, and writing articles in newspapers and our alumni magazines, reaching thousands of people. We donated books to local libraries and promoted our stories on websites and social media with videos and blogs. We hosted two book launch events in 2022, one in Washington, D.C., and one on the West Coast, with almost 200 people attending those events. A copy was given to the Liberian ambassador in Washington, D.C., and then several FOL members traveled to Liberia in October 2022 for a brief visit to not only provide volunteer service, but also to deliver the anthology to the National Museum of Liberia, the We Care Project, and the U.S. Ambassador to Liberia in Monrovia. The most revealing of all was the feedback we received from our audience. I didn't know Peace Corps still existed. I am accepted into Peace Corps and I want to learn more from you before I go. I never knew anything about Liberia and what Peace Corps did, but I do now. Shirley approached me at the end of our book launch and said, I was taught by a Peace Corps volunteer in Liberia, and because of him, I believed in myself and received my college education. Our newest Peace Corps recruit is our university intern, Dante McFadden. After his three-month FOL dream internship, as he called it, his exposure to FOL and Liberia influenced him. He plans to join the Peace Corps in Africa after his graduation in 2024. During the COVID pandemic, when there were no volunteers in the country for over three years, FOL's work in Liberia never stopped. All proceeds from the sale of our books benefit ongoing family literacy, health, and small grant NGO programs all based in Liberia. At the beginning of the pandemic, FOL shipped desperately needed oxygen regulators and PPE equipment to Liberia. We partnered with Global Health Ministries for the shipment of more PPEs and additional medical supplies distributed by the FOL Liberian Health Team. We collaborated with WeCare to deliver family literacy supplies during COVID for their program to continue. We hope you will vote for FOL and our anthology, Never the Same Again, for the Lorette Rupi Award for Outstanding Community Service. As we continue to promote Peace Corps' mission, our goal for peace and being a global citizen, 
as we say in my Liberian village, Izudu. Thank you, yeah.